What's up everyone, my name is Drew and today we're making cocktails on tap utilizing the Micromatic Beverage Station. Now the cocktail we're gonna do today is one of the most popular cocktails in 2022, rolling into 2023. I think every restaurant and bar has this on their menu now and that's the classic espresso martini. Now, traditionally, espresso martinis are utilized with, with some type of sweetener, coffee, and vodka. However, I like to switch it up a little bit. I prefer agave spirits or tequila in my espresso martinis. It works so well with the coffee. For this recipe, we're gonna add a touch of cinnamon as well. So that's gonna add this really beautiful spice element that kind of almost mend the tequila and the coffee together. It's gonna be absolutely outstanding. But before we do, anything when we're batching cocktails, we have to have tools, right? So the tools that I recommend that we utilize is you have to have something to measure, right? So this is a silicone measuring cup, a whisk, we need a funnel, and of course you need a mesh strainer. Now any cocktails that we do on tap, we wanna make sure that we strain that cocktail out. So you're shaking margaritas, you wanna strain it if you're stirring old fashions or even the espresso martini, you wanna make sure you have a mesh strainer. What that's gonna allow us to do is protect the micromatic system. It allows us to remove all the pulp and solids from the lines so that whenever the gas is integrated into that cocktail itself, the guests are getting the best experience. So the mesh strainer really protects your entire system and your investment, which is great. So we're gonna go ahead and move these tools out of the way. I'm gonna place my funnel on top of the micromatic beverage tank as well as my mesh strainer. And because of movie magic, we went ahead and we batched our cocktail. So here is our espresso martini. We have our agave spirit, our tequila. We also have our coffee and we have our cinnamon syrup. One thing I also like to add is add a touch of Grand Marnier to it. That orange flavor is gonna work really well. But I also added dilution. Now when you're shaking cocktails behind the bar in your tins, you're gonna add about 15 to 20% of dilution or more water to your cocktail. If you're stirring a cocktail, it's roughly around 10 to 12. So when you batch, you have to account for that. So we went ahead and accounted for 18% of dilution. We added it to this mix as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour this in. Perfect. We're gonna go ahead and remove our tools. Now the innovation of Micromatic on this beverage tank is superb. This is a NSF certified stainless steel beverage tank. It's five gallons. Now the recipe that we created was one gallon. So if you times that by five, you can do just over a hundred espresso martinis in one batch, which is absolutely fantastic. When you think about it as an operator, creating a more consistent drink for your guests. And then as a bartender, I can pour espresso martinis from the tap system in a matter of moments quick garnish and then it's out the door and the guests are enjoying that at record time. So this is a fantastic piece of equipment. What also I love about it is they innovated and created these, what they're called mixing sticks. Now these mixing sticks allows us to drop it into the system. This tank sits on a magnetic base and it will actually stir your cocktail for you. So gone are the days that you need bartenders in the back shaking kegs or bar backs. This system will actually stir your cocktail for the life of the entire cocktail inside the keg, which I think is absolutely incredible and it's a game changer for sure. So we're just gonna drop that in there and then we're gonna put the lid on. Perfect. Awesome, so now that we have the cocktail all inside of our, our beverage tank, we're gonna go ahead and hook it up. Now that we've poured our espresso martini, it's time to garnish. So we're gonna take our microplane, a little bit of chocolate over the top. Actually, a lot of chocolate over the top. Perfect. And then we're gonna express a little bit of orange too. Around, and there we go. So this is our espresso martini pour from the Micromatic Beverage Station. Cheers.